Without objection, the gentleman is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. This is Crime Victims Rights Week, and back in 2004, I introduced the Crime Victims Rights Act, which was signed into law by President Bush as part of the Justice for All Act. Under that landmark legislation, crime victims were finally awarded criminal rights in federal criminal cases, including the right to protection, the right to timely notice, not to be excluded, and to be heard at all public hearings, the right to confer with the prosecutor, the right to restitution, the right to a speedy trial, and the right to privacy. Several years later, the GAO found that too many victims were not aware of these important rights and that more needed to be done to educate victims. You see, in civics class, we all learn about the rights of the accused, but very little attention is given to the rights of victims. And so, Mr. Speaker, as we commemorate National Crime Victims Rights Week this week, it's important that we make sure victims know what their rights are under the law. It's the least we can do to show victims the respect and dignity that they deserve. Yield back.